Hey guys, welcome back to another Clash Royale video, and today we'll be taking a look at one of the hottest hog decks in the entire game right now. That is this strategy right here: a 2.9 elixir hog rider elite barbarian bomber earthquake deck. It is absolutely absurd how popular this deck has become over the past couple of days, literally exploding in popularity by over 10 times in just a few days. It is such a fun and fast-paced strategy. You have the elite barbarians in there. For destroying enemy tanks and also applying pressure. You have the hog rider as a win condition. You have the firecracker and the earthquake as your backup win conditions for cycle damage. Then you have the bomber for destroying all of the swarm in the meta right now. And the great thing is, is both of these cards kind of act like a bit of spell bait as well. And overall, just an effective strategy in Clash Royale. Now, once again, guys and girls, if you're supporting the channel, go ahead, throw in creator code Shane into your shop before buying things like pass rails or special offers or gems. It is a fantastic way to support the channel and honestly helps a lot more than you might think so thank you if you are rocking code chain in your shop yo mr gudron the true gudron <laughs> yeah good luck to you my friend not really the greatest starting rotation here when he goes skeletons back here just to kind of cycle see what he's got would have preferred the hog rider to be honest but that's okay he's gonna have a sappiest deck maybe fireball bait maybe piggies maybe recruits maybe leap barbarians we don't really know right now we shall just wait and see oh okay that's interesting a little minor action there I suppose. You're gonna go... Oh, what? This is not what I thought it was gonna be, dudes. If he's got arrows, we're in some big trouble here, boys. Come on, E-Barbs. Yo, what? We got two swings? How is that balanced, E-Barbs? Uh, it's Inferno Tower here. Natal to the King Tower? You lost again. You never win. Ever win. You're stupid. No one likes you. Fed up. We need to stop telling you lies and tell you the truth. You're annoying. Oh, uh, that's a Sparky dude. Sparky Rage that it appears to be. He's gonna go giant in front of this Sparkinator, and we have zero Zappage, zero E Dragon, zero Electro Wizard, and zero Lightning Spell. Which you know what that equals? If you guys did your homework yesterday, that equals a very, very dead shade. It's one of these. It's one of these here. Okay. I mean, we're not dead. Yet. We're not dead. Surprisingly, I'm gonna go a little hog rider action right this business. See if we can't punish that over aggressive play by him. I mean, that's uh, ooh, okay. Do one of these here. Okay, cool. So as long as we can defend for the last minute here, we should be fine. But defending is the issue. It sounds easier than it is. Defending herein lies the issue. Let's go Earthquake here. One of these here, please. Come on. Nice, let's go. One of these, one of these. Come on, boys. Don't let me down now, dudes. Don't let me down now, dudes. Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's do one of these. All right. We're fine. We're chilling. We're vibing. A bit of a scary battle there. But uh, so far, it appears to be okay. Let's do one of these here. Let's go, boys. All right. That's one log away from dying. Bomber here, please. He barbs this down. And I think, I think we chill in here, boys. Hey. Oh yeah, dude, the ice cream prediction on the miner there, good game. If I were him, I would have utilized the minion horde more. Cause there's many times I used the firecracker out of rotation. He could have easily punished with minion horde, but he didn't, so good game. Uh oh, the Mega Knight tower skin, the one and only of the tower skin of the Mega Knights. Hoggy woggy here and a natal to the cane tower. That is gonna be a natal deck, potentially. Oh, it's one of them. That's kind of sus. One of these here. All right. Firecrash is getting some stuff done. Oh, it's a double barrel annoying spam deck. Super annoying, dudes. 
super annoying here, eh? Yeah, Shane, yes, it is annoying. Well, thank you, my friends, for agreeing with me. Goblin Gang here, left lane, or Skarmy? This deck uses Skarmy. Yeah, it does use a Skarmy, dude. It do. Sometimes it uses building, sometimes it does not use building. Hmm? I suppose we'll find out right now. Is it all, Tesla? It's the Inferno Tower. Come on, fuck like a one-shot in the tower, please. Yes, sure. So, the King to activation is activated. But that's okay. It's basically guaranteed with this deck. Like, you basically gotta go into it expecting the King to activation. And we overcommitted with that Ice Golem there. Maybe the Bomber would have been enough by itself. I just wanted to avoid a scenario where the Bomber died to the Skeleton Barrel Skeletons. Because I used it accidentally. Not accidentally, but on purpose. Uh, uh, too far up. So, that's on me. It's 100% my fault. And now I'm just going to be sad. Ooh, okay. Let's go one of these hog riders by itself here. Inferno Tower again. Oh, it does. Okay. I was joking, sir. I was joking, my friend, about that. Uh, I hope you know that I was actually joking. Wait for it. All right. So we get a little bit of tower damage done. You know, it's not the end of the world. This is fine. We vibing over here, boys. It was at this moment that he knew. He nice, dude. He didn't have enough of the infernal tower there. That's some insane uh, tower damage right there, boys. Actually insane. Actually insane tower damage right there. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Dude. Dude. Do you even know who I am, sir? Do you even know? My name is Shane, and I am a nub. Can I hit that? Oh, I can't hit that. Lame shush. Some of these here, boys. Some of these in this business is here, boys. Good game. Well played. I would say that we had absolute hard counter here, and we kind of do, so I will say that. Good game, sir. Well played. Integrity X. Sounds like a new kind of like uh, like a new startup company. We are Integrity X. The wave of the future. No? Okay. Ignore me. <laughs> oh, no. It's a Dark Princey Boy deck, eh? Okay. 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 Just please don't... Whatever you do, just please don't be freaking arrows, man. Oh, okay. I mean, it's something. It's double prints. Regular prints right here. Oh, come on, broski. The NATO sausage in there? Come on, dude. You why? Hey, wait. Come on, bro. Hmm. Oh my goodnesses, it's a, it's, okay. I was hoping that would not be the case, but it is that deck. And now I'm just gonna be freaking sad panda right here, dude. Holy macaronis. Somebody send me help, please. I mean, we pull that packet over with one of those, eh? That's all right. Firecracker's kind of having a hard time hitting her target. Come on, Firecracker. Shoot faster, you nub. Okay. I mean, that's all right. Electro Wizard there. Shoots that down like this. One of these here in this business is. One of these here in this business is here. Another Nato to the King Tower in the business in the right lane. Misses the polo, so we get one hoggy shoddy. And it's looking okay so far. Oh, the Executioner? <sighs> oh my bro skis <sighs> um oh it's a balloon oh no we're so freaking dead it's a balloon no please this has got no air defense bro this deck balloon is the arch nemesis balloon is the only deck in this in this uh, only card that you really just get actually shrekt by is the uh, is the balloon. 
Like, you could actually just win here by going just by balloon by itself. Yeah. Like, we can't, we can't do anything for that. Out of all the possible decks you can use... Balloon's the only one that's, like, actually shreks you. Let's go one of these here, boys. Let's go one of these here. Let's get this down, please. Come on, boys. Go. Let's back here. And he's here. Oh, dude. How do we win that? Yeah, wow. Wow. Bro, I got one air defense card. How do you not win with the balloon? Broski. <laughs> GG's, man. Well played. Oh, no. It's a Night Ice Spirit deck. Maybe it's a Hexpo deck. Is it Expo? It might be. Nah, what's gonna be a log bait deck? Oh, annoying. Uber lame sauce. Uber lame sausage. One of these. Wait for it. One of these here, please. What's back here, please? Nice. All right, we chill him. We vibing here, boys. We vibing. Oh, dude, imagine I got that princess there. Just imagine. Use your minds and just imagine that for a hot minute here. That would have been insanity. But we're we're losing right now. He's playing pretty well. I respect this guy's grind here so far. This matchup can honestly go either way with this deck, depending on how the the bait player plays. And the biggest key to victory is the princesses, because you don't you don't have anything that really to really effective to destroy her. I'm assuming it's going to be Infernal Tower here. Let's go, boys. Uh, can we get the bomber to get two throws on that princess, please? Two throws, please, bomber. There's one. Can we get one more, please, bomber? Thank you, sir. I appreciate your assistance in the destruction of that little princess. Come on, Infernal Tower right here. Yeah. I'm not even going to bother earthquaking that down. It's a negative one trade for him if I don't do anything, so it is what it is, and it's not what it's not. And it'll be... Oh! I thought I had my log selected. I don't know why I went Firecracker. We still got damage lead, but this is not going good so far. I misdropped a Firecracker there. That's three elixir that I'll never get back in my life. And now I'm very, very sad, dude. Broski, is that what you really wanted, my friend? I suppose the same could be said to me, right? Is that what I really wanted is the question here. Let's go one of these. Oh. Oh. <laughs> oh, what? We get no hog shot? I mean, e-barb shots? What? In the who? In the when? And the how is that legal, Clash Roy? Come on, broski! Cut me a break here! That was clutch! Yeah, we're dead. Oh, man. Oh, man. Can we all just collectively be sad about myself right now? Ebarb's here, please. Wait for it. One of these here, please. Okay, let's go. Let's go, boys. Let's go. EQ this down, please. Fuck back here, please. Oh, no. That sucks, dude. Bomber here. Bomber back here, please. I should need one Earthquake and one Law to win. I just need one Log to win, boys. Can we do it in time? Loggy spell right here, go down please. John L, good game my friend. Well played. The one e bar just got a, a ton of damage done by itself. My dear friend, Elise. Sir? Sir? <laughs> Sorry. I just thought of a really lame joke and I will spare y'all from the uh, from listening to it. So, uh, oh, 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 oh no. It's gonna be one of these annoying piggy decks. Uh, 
Okay. The reason I say this deck is annoying is we have zero responses for a uh, flying machine. That's why. That's why y'all. It's it's annoying deck. Okay. That's why. Okay, guys and girls, don't question me. Come on, brawler, die. Yeah, he dead. He big dead. All right. So if he goes uh, piggies here, what's our plan? Honestly, though, the key to the key to victory for him is successful use of the flying machine. If he can use the flying machine successfully, he can win this game easily. We haven't seen it yet, but I can almost guarantee it's in there, dude. 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 A dude. All right, cool. Hmm. Let's go. Let's do one of these in this business is here. Thank you, sir. I mean, I'm okay with the king's activation as long as you guys are. Can we just collectively be okay with that right now? Just join our hands in communion of being okay with that. Please. Hey, Ray, we got some tower damage done there, boys. I cannot go anything here because he's going to have stuff. I can go hog right into this, though. He's going to go goblin cage with this. Oh, just a fly machine, eh? I, I regret doing that right now. I regret that entirely, dude. What the freak was I thinking, broski? Let's go. Okay. I know he's got the, what did we call it, in hand here. So I don't particularly want to go anything cray cray. Let's put this down, please. Okay. Uh, that that was kind of cray cray right there, was it not? Put this down. Put one of these. Put one of these here, please. All right, we're doing okay. We're vibing. I was a little scared. I was a little more scared there than we needed to be. But I think we're chilling here. I think we're vibing. I think we're good. Let's go, boys. Let's go. Wait for it. Log this back right here, please. Put one of these here, please. EQ this down, please. Oh, thank you, Firecracker. Should an EQ right here, please. Go. Oh, that was close. Like literally a fractional of one more second and we would have died. Oh, I miscalculated the time for the earthquake. But dude, GG's man. Anyways, guys and girls, that is in the video. Here's the deck one more time. If you want to give it a try yourself, guys, a very, very successful push with it today. Nice little undefeated streak, beating a semi-wide variety of decks. We beat uh, Sparky, we beat Log Bait, we beat uh, Double Barrel, we beat Pekka Balloon somehow, some way. And then we beat uh, Royal Hogs uh, uh, Recruits. Like, absolutely absurd. Very, very happy with this deck so far, guys. Give it a try. Let me know how it goes for you. But he's in the video. Thank you for watching. We shall see you in the next one.